All right, day one in the books. Uh, how would you just kind of assess how today went? Uh, it, we, we had a good day today. You know, um, just, you know, it was hot out there. But, you know, we had a good day overall. Defense did good. Uh, I don't know. can't speak for the offense because I'm not over there. But, you know, overall, we had a good day today. But, you know, it's still room for improvement. You know, we just got to get better, put this day behind us, and keep going. How much does having that core, those core veterans on the defensive side, kind of help just mesh and get things going quicker maybe this year? Yeah, it, it, it's, it's big for us, man. We got a bunch of coaches on the field. You know, that's, that's going to be big for us. We know the playbook in and out. And um, just having them veteran guys, man, make everything easier, kind of slow the game down even more. And uh, I'm just looking forward to go and play this year with those guys. A lot of guys could have left after last year. What does it mean to this defense to, to have those guys back? Yeah, it, it means a lot, man. You know, like you said, a lot of guys could have left, but, you know, we decided to come back, you know, do something big. And just to have the veteran guys back, man, I'm telling you, it just feels so different out there. You know, it just feels the game just slowed down for everybody. So, you know, it's good to have the vet guys back see the rankings that got released. Is there any talk about where you guys are, where the teams are that you're facing? Because you have a hard schedule this year. I don't even know where we rank. You know what? 16. 16. Oh, OK. Uh, <laughs> you know, it, it, it doesn't matter, man. I'm not into the numbers and things like that. And you know, everybody says something about our schedule. We got the hardest schedule, you know. But this is what we want. You know, this is what you come to Auburn for. This is what you play for. So I mean, I'm not into the numbers and things like that, man. I'm in competing each and every week. So you know, we just take care of our business every, every week. How would you describe? Coach Steele's uh, style of coaching a minute ago, your teammate told us that you know he's like a dad figure almost. He'll get on you and almost mm -hmm. laugh it off a little bit. Mm -hmm. How would you kind of describe him? Yeah, well, I, that's KJ said that. Yeah, so yeah, he he is kind of a dad figure, man. You know, he's gonna coach you hard, coach you hard, but you know, at the end of the day, he's gonna love you too, man. And, and that's to have a coach like that. You know, that's that's just a blessing to me. Like I told those guys down there, you know, I think this is our fourth year going on having him. You know, that's very rare to have a coach like that. You know, in this type of business where you know coaches leave and things like that to get better jobs, but you know, just the, we know the system in and out, man. And he's he's an aggressive coach. Just to let y'all know, he's very aggressive on the play, but you know he's like a dad figure, and I tell him every time. So you know it's good to have him. How have you seen Coach Melzon change this off season going into the fall? I mean, he's, you know, I, I don't know. You know, a lot of people say he changed, but uh, I can say he's he's just more laid back, man. Just let the seniors, let the vet guys kind of control because you know he always tells us it's our team, and, and that's what it is. It is our team, but. You know, he's kind of laid back, you know, but he's still Coach Miles on. He's still been on us when he needs to be. But, man, just to have a coach like Coach Miles on, too. You know, he's been here since my freshman year, too. So, I mean, it's, it's a blessing just to have those type of coaches just to stay here with you. What's your role as one of those vet guys now? Just lead, man. Just lead. I know everybody's going to follow my step, you know, so I can't come out there dragging. You know, I got to come out there and bring energy and things like that, keep the guys going. So that's just my my. my Role this year, man. Just lead, lead the right way. Cause you, as a leader, you can have a bad leader as well. But you know, I want to be a good leader. I want to be a good example for my guys. So, just be a leader.